Afternoon guys, just finished off with a, a bench press workout. Uh, we're going to take a look at some footage from that soon. Um, we've got to, uh, I've, uh, I've widened my, my grip on the bench press a little bit, uh, which is making it a little more, a bit more comfortable, uh, a little easier to push the, the heavier weights. It's engaging the chest more, uh, relying on the arms a little less, uh, and uh, my arms are definitely the weak point. Uh, so it's it's made it a little easier to to push the heavier weight. Um, so we'll go straight into it. Today I worked up to a heavy of 80. I tried 82 and a half. Uh, it wasn't quite there. Only got a quarter of the way up. Uh, I knew it wasn't worth trying again. It wasn't even close. Uh, so from there I dropped down to uh, 67 and a half kilos for five sets of five. While I'm doing my five sets of five, um, I giant set those with bent over rows, 45 kilos, uh, 10 reps, and oblique crunches, 20 kilos, 10 reps on each side. So let's take a look at that. to a shallow angle incline bench with some dumbbells. Uh, it allows you to make sure that both your arms are working equally as hard so both sides of your body are getting the same amount of, of work in. Uh, it helps to identify if there's a weak side and therefore you can you can work a little harder on that side to bring it up to bring it up to spec with the other one. So I'm doing with 22 kilo dumbbells um, so I'm working at about three quarters of what my working sets were on the bench press. 
Um, so 22 kilo dumbbells, one in each hand, um, slight incline. I do five reps of those. Uh, as you can see, as I come up, I twist them to bring them closer together to engage the uh, the middle of my chest a little more. Uh, immediately following that, uh, I superset those with uh, bent over flies to work on the uh, on the rear delts. Now. Uh, I do these with some fairly light weights. Today it was six kilos, and I'm doing ten reps of that. Um, and I did five sets of that super set. On the last set, um, for the for the incline dumbbell press, I was I upped it to 24 kilo dumbbells, uh, and actually went for ten reps. Uh, it was hard work, <laughs> but I managed to drive it out. Managed to grind it out. Accessory work, more focusing on the uh, the triceps um, to try and bring my arms a bit closer to what's needed for the to bring my bench up. So it's definitely what's restricting my bench at the moment. So I'm super setting skull crushers um, with close grip bench press. Now I've been using I'm using the easy curl curl bar for this because uh, it allows a slightly different hand position. When the bar's straight, it puts a bit of strain in my elbows for the skull crushers, so the uh, the angled parts on the easy bar allow me to relieve that strain. And yet still, I'm still able to do a close grip bench press with that too. Um, when I'm doing skull crushers, I prefer to keep my... I find it better to keep my elbows slightly further back, uh, like up, up in line, sort of at the top of my head. That way, as my arms are going back and forward the tension is constantly on my triceps whereas if my elbows were further forward when you when I get to the top out here the tension comes off the triceps um, and and you're putting uh, less work into them uh, from there you go I go immediately into the close grip bench press so today uh, I've done that with I did the first set with 20 kilos 10 reps another set went on to 25 kilos for 10 reps uh, and in the third set, uh, I didn't have another 10 left in me, uh, so I did 5 reps of each, again with 25 kilos. the main part of the workout from on there I went and did uh, some tricep pull downs I'm sure you've seen plenty of those so I, I haven't bothered with any footage for that um, I did as I usually do in there uh, like, con like just one set straight after the other uh, just as many reps as possible increase the weight as many reps as possible increase the weight I do four or five sets like that and then drop the weight down to 50 60 percent of my top one and again, just do as many reps as possible. Uh, at the bottom of each rep, um, I, I find it very beneficial to, really, to focus on really locking out, squeezing the triceps. Pumps a lot of blood in there. You can you can feel the feel the difference. So uh, that's it for today, guys. Um, I should have some more later in the week for you. So always remember, whatever you're, wherever you're at, aim high, train hard, and eventually achieve great things. See you later in the week.